case you were wondering, mm -hmm. yes, I gained weight again. Satsumi Tachibana, world history teacher at Koyo Women's Academy, 29 and single. I wasn't. And it's not obvious when looking at you. Oh, it's real obvious when I'm undressed. Well, that's okay. I mean, it's not like there's anyone actually looking, right? Thanks, Miss Aina. Would you like me to turn the other cheek so you can slap it, too? If you're feeling bad about it, why don't you just start working out? Silverman Gym, hmm. They've got branches all over the world, so it's gotta be good. And they just opened one up around here. <laughs> around here? Try right here. So you'll have an easier commute to work. Hmm. What if I run into my students or one of their parents in there? I'm not comfortable with my work and private life overlapping. Don't worry about the parents. And high school girls aren't going to spend their free time in a gym. Just go, they're even offering a free trial, look. You're right. I'm being ridiculous. Maybe I'll check it out after work today. Going to the gym after school? Yeah, duh! <laughs> students. Hey, Miss Tachibana! You work out here too? How cool is that? She's a second year student. That's right, Hibiki Sakura in Class B. Her grades could <laughs> use some work. And this is Akimi Soryuin from Class A, student council president and dream student. Why are they friends? I'm so confused. So yeah, um, I'm just here because there was a free trial today. Cool, well, I hope you like it. We just joined too, and so far it's pretty dope. It'd be great if you joined. Then maybe you could get all swole with Hibiki and me. All swole? Um, what's that? Oh my gosh, don't listen to her. She's got a boner for grossly huge muscles. Well, isn't that fun? She may be a teacher, but she's also a woman with needs. Hi, Celia, you're here to bring that bod to life. Little some extra to wake the men's up. Yeah? <laughs> Ugh, just when I thought it couldn't get any worse. Why is this happening? I do not want to work out in front of my students. Yo, teach, it's this way. <laughs> oh well, at least I don't have to come back after today. Hello and welcome. I'll be your trainer today, Naruzo Machio. It's quite a pleasure to meet you. This is Miss Tachibana. She teaches world history at our school. Really? That's awesome. Then let's make your first day fun and all train together. <laughs> <laughs> I'd like a membership to you. The ladies love a sleek tracksuit. That's it. She's in love. What's your fitness goal? Are you an athlete? No, not at all. It's just that every time I step on the scale, the numbers go up, and I'd like that to stop. I tried doing basic exercises at home on the weekends, but I was sore for four days straight and I can't work like that. I totally know what you mean. My mom is always complaining about how your body doesn't heal as fast and that it's harder to lose weight when you get older. Fight me, bitch. Do I remind you of your mom now? Okay, you saw that, right? She wants to kill me. Can you remember what kind of exercises you were doing at home? Floor stuff, push-ups, squats, sit-ups, back stretches on my hands and knees. Good for you. 
Which part of your body is usually the sorest after? Which part? Is it weird if everything hurts at the same time? I usually don't exercise much at all, so... It's real bad. I shouldn't work out when I'm this sore, huh? I'll just go home. Oh no, that's not gonna work with me. You can still exercise. We just have to target the muscles that aren't sore while letting the other ones rest up. Match yours, muscle lesson of the day. Hey there, you shredded yet? Today I'm gonna show you how to cut up those biceps. Let's do some curls using dumbbells. Is he stripping for us? And what the crap does shredded mean? You're gonna have to roll with it, because this is gonna happen a lot. <laughs> Grab your dumbbells and hold them down by your thighs. Keep your shoulders back and relaxed. As you lift the weight, make sure to keep your elbows glued to your sides. Using momentum to swing the weight up will reduce the isolation in your bicep. To prevent injuries and work the muscle's full range of motion, start with your palms neutral and then rotate the weight up into a curl. When lowering the dumbbell, be careful not to extend your elbow past its natural resting position. Okay, but what if I'm still a little sore from the push-ups I did a few days ago? Not to worry! The primary muscles we use for push-ups are the triceps. Back here, they're engaged in an active rest as you work the biceps. When you curl the arm, your biceps are contracting and your triceps are extending. It's best to train muscles as a pair so that your strength and growth are balanced. If your triceps are feeling sore, then we gotta smoke the biceps too. That's the way to get a full body workout and some hardcore gains too. Except the last thing I wanna do is gain. Let's start with the two kilo weights for now. Really? That's pretty light. Are you sure it'll work? Absolutely. Learning proper form is more important than kilos. We'll do a few sets of these so we've got to start with a weight that helps us perform efficiently. Lots of people come in here and just start lifting the heaviest weight they can on day one, especially the men. Yeah, because men. I can see that. Starting a set with weights that are too heavy causes you to use momentum to cheat your reps, and that cuts your results in half. Look, you see how they're able to complete each rep without using momentum? Uh, yeah. I never tell a client to do something I don't do myself, so I keep my weights manageable too. I only use 50 kgs for my dumbbell curls. <laughs> we are not the same species. I question whether or not he's even real. All right, you ready to give it a try? You can alternate arms until you build up your strength. Thank you. One, two, three, that's four, five, six. This is hard, even with light weights. How many more are left? Best part is, you don't even need to buy a dumbbell set for that amount of weight. An average sized bottle of water would work just as well. How about a small one? Yeah, Miss Tachibana being a boss. Are you two finished already? Hell yeah! We nailed those sets like hammerhead sharks! Wow, that's impressive! Look how much your stamina's already increased! <laughs> what the? Um, Miss Tachibana? I don't want to interrupt your training session, but... Too late. What's up, Miss Sodiyuin? I just noticed the diamond tan line on your stomach. What's it from? I've never seen that before. <laughs> no! Oh, that's weird. You must have a freaky swimsuit. No, I, uh, I was experimenting with a few to see which one looked best. Oh, nice. You got one of those guys who likes variety, don't you? Sure. Can we change the subject, please? Come on, you two. Let her get back to her workout. <laughs> Miss Tachibana is a grown woman, and what she does in her private time is none of our business, okay? <laughs> to each their own, even teachers. Okay. I appreciate him coming to my rescue like that, but... They could not be more wrong about what I'm into. Uh, I need a nap. Miss Tachibana, high five. Yeah, can work today. Be safe getting home, okay? Yes. All secrets uh, shared in the gym. Mm -hmm. Stay in the gym. There's been a misunderstanding. It's not what you think. Ugh, I'm starving. Yeah, you pushed really hard today. <laughs> have some protein bars. I mean, like, <laughs> Why did I panic like that? It's not like my real secret was revealed. No student would ever take me seriously again. A cosplayer teacher? They'd lose their minds. Seems like a lot of my looks were feeling a little bit tighter after the last event. The gym was a good idea. I've got to get back in shape before the next one. Little amendment from earlier. Although she's known by many as their history teacher, there are also those who know Miss Tachibana as the famous cosplayer Yulia Rico.
Her motivation on this fitness journey? She's preparing for a major event. Oh, so you two are going to the same gym. That makes way more sense. You're way too good for Hibiki. Thanks, Miss Uehara. That's nice of you to say. Do you see my grandma here? Girl, just call me Ayaka. You guys, I'm starving. Can you continue to bond while we eat, please? You're not starving. You're just hangry. And you need to tell that tummy monster to chill. Thanks for letting me eat with you. Woohoo! Lunchtime rules! No way! Did she pack lunches for all of us, or...? Is it just me? Huh? Or does your bento box look a little different today? It's larger. Yeah! I found a bigger one at home, so I thought, why not? But I pack the same things as I always do. See? Same old stuff! What, are you feeding a sports team? Is all this supposed to be one meal for you? No, it's my breakfast too. I like to sleep as late as possible, so I don't always have time to eat before I leave. There are reality shows about people like you. I'm trying not to eat until lunchtime. Aren't you proud of me for cutting back on some of my meals? Everyone was giving me attitude about snacks, so they're gone. Now I'm on this diet where I only eat once a day. Uh, except you weren't created with willpower. Yeah, huh? I just haven't used it yet. My body's gonna be so banging this summer, you don't even know. Okay, hold on. That's not a diet. It actually has the opposite effect. I mean, sumo wrestlers eat like that to gain weight for their matches. <laughs> Time for Akami's diet lesson. When your body's been deprived of food for several hours, and then you decide to binge, your blood sugar levels increase drastically. This causes the pancreas to secrete tons of insulin, a hormone that distributes energy or calories to cells where it is needed. Overeating provokes excess insulin. With nowhere else to go, this energy is distributed to the muscles and fat cells. Your body reads this as a need to survive and stores fat to protect you from starvation. In other words, skipping important meals isn't helping. When you eat a huge lunch instead of eating breakfast or dinner, you'll probably notice you gain weight faster. Yeah, that makes sense to me. <laughs> ah, I'm doing everything the wrong way! There's no chance I'll be skinny by summer now! Kibuki, you're fine! <laughs> There's plenty of time before summer! Have you ever considered trying a basic bodybuilder's diet? What? They have their own specific diet? <laughs> Is that what it is? This is what you're imagining? Why do you have him screaming while he's eating? It's not what you're thinking. It's more than just lifting the most amount of weight. It's like an art form. They also focus on cutting and shaping for aesthetics and try to be under 3% body fat before competitions. Whoa, under 3%? That's also what boxers aim for before they're scheduled to fight. When it comes to precise dieting, bodybuilders are the experts. Here, let's take a look at my bento box. <gasps> Wow, look how colorful it is. Hibiki, are you taking notes? I always make sure my meal is nutritionally balanced. Yeah, Hibiki loves herself a hot fried mess. Yours is grilled and steamed and whole. That's freaking sexy. I get it. It's not the food. I bet we're eating the same things. It's how you prepare it that can add or subtract calories. What are you saying? When the amount of nutrients is the same, try to choose the lower calorie option. Mm, I know that grilled stuff is good for me. But even if I ate it for all three meals, I'd still be hungry. I need more. That's why I eat a few snacks throughout the day. Seriously? How do you snack and stay skinny? Because I only snack twice a day and my meals are much smaller. Plus, you just started. This is how a bodybuilder's diet works. You never want to stuff yourself. You decrease the amount of food you eat, but you eat smaller meals more often. This prevents your blood sugar from spiking out because you're never actually taking in calories on an empty stomach. Examples of some good-sized snacks include protein bars or maybe a can of mackerel. There's also protein drinks, of course. Just choose meals that are high in protein and low in calories. That's why Mr. Machio said we should keep eating. That's what I'm gonna do! I'm switching to a bodybuilder's diet starting now! I'm gonna be hot AF this summer! <sighs> <laughs> it's so hard! I don't know if I can! Are you kidding me? She gave up before she even started! <laughs> Cheer up, it'll all be okay! You never have to cut those high-calorie comfort foods from your diet completely! Take a cheat day! Eat whatever you want! It actually makes your diet more effective! When you're on a low-calorie diet, your body will eventually think... I haven't eaten enough today. That's when it enters energy-saving mode! 
The cheat day can counteract this. Strategically indulging tricks your body into thinking it's got enough calories to expend and gives your metabolism a boost. Mmm, I have lots of calories. Cool, so I can lose weight by eating junk food? While we're here, can I just say it's great for stress release too, or is that just me? Different subject. Having one cheat day a week can be good when starting a new diet. Yes! I can do this now! Thank you! I'm going on a brand new diet starting today! a diet that I can stick to. I love cheat day. No, wait. You're doing it wrong. Your body has to get used to low calories first. Otherwise, it's not gonna work. Just stop. She quit listening at cheat day. Believe it or not, Hibiki is still nowhere near her goal. Look to your left. Yes. Can you face me? Awesome. Oh, I love that pose. Thank goodness. Joining that gym definitely paid off. I lost exactly what I needed to, and just in time for the show. My body still isn't where I want it to be, but I'm getting there. Mr. Machio's a great trainer. He made hitting the gym five days a week after work bearable. I actually enjoyed working out with him. I don't think I'll ever get used to going to the same gym as my students, though. It's whatever. At least they never figured out the real reason I was there. Being called out by those girls would suck. Whoa! I wonder why everyone's freaking out over that cosplayer. Uh, it might be because of what she's wearing. Their hair! Why? That voice, it's familiar. Huh? Uh, no. Why are they looking around like that? Is it me? Did they figure it out somehow? Uh, ha! I found you! <laughs> We've been looking everywhere for you, mister. Hey, I'm so glad you guys showed up. Cool. Have you always been into cosplay? No, a friend of mine just invited me out here to try it with him, but... Oh, great. He's here, make. too? I could be wrong, but I think I recognize your costume. I would hope so. It's from the very first muscle manga. It was called Lips with a Straight Bar. Is that even a real thing? Oh, yeah, I totally remember that series. My older brother used to collect it growing up. It's pretty popular. Especially after it was serialized in Monthly Muscle Man Mag. Everyone knows about it unless they're living in a hole. False! I'm thriving above ground! Huh? Lifts with the straight bar! Oh yeah, the Muscle King was such a badass! Excuse me! Can I take a picture, please? Let can me you do a cool pose for me! What? Is the manga really that popular? Excuse me, can you do the pose? Of course! You guys ready? Here it goes! <laughs> <laughs> Show the Muscle King how big your muscles really are! He's doing quotes now? What the hell? He said it! He said the line! That quote was from the early editions! Man, you look just like him! That's amazing! That crowd is obsessed with him! Man, he is really taking me back! He looks just like him, doesn't he? Even those who recognize it? Am I the only one who's never read this? Uh, hey, is there any way you could do that one scene? Oh, you mean the scene scene? For sure. I'm gonna need to grab something long. Something long like a barbell that you just happen to have right there? This is not even cosplay anymore! You're gonna wanna use video for this. I'm about to reenact one of the most famous scenes. See if you know it. I don't know if I can do this! My deltoids are all out of gym! Yeah, you're lifting the bar! That's awkward! It makes no sense! Yeah! Michael King's scene! The final front press! You're amazing, man! Terrible, and they're eating it up! Who the hell is this Muscle King? Machio's Muscle Lesson of the Day. Hello, everybody. Today we're gonna learn the right way to do a front press. How do we get to this part already? This exercise is great for sculpting every part of the shoulders. Okay, good talk. I'll wait. Grab the bar from above using an overhand grip. Position it just above your collarbone. Keep your chest squared and your elbows facing front. Lift the bar, being careful not to fully extend your elbows. Then lower the bar and return to your starting position. That's one. That's all there is to it. Warning, avoid compensating by bending your upper body. You could seriously hurt your lower back. Keep the posture straight by engaging the abs and protecting the spine. The front press is excellent for smoking the heck out of those front and middle deltoids. As your shoulders start growing wider, you'll notice your waist looks slimmer in contrast. That's why women usually love this exercise. How did this become a training session? So exhausted. 
At least Mr. Machio's new cosplay fame made it easier for me to leave undiscovered. That could have been really bad. I just didn't think I'd ever run into students here. But I'm safe. They didn't see me. Wait, is that Miss Tochibana? <laughs> yeah, you're right. Hey, how's it going? I didn't know you were here. I need to die. Right now. Huh? What's with the luggage? <laughs> I think I know. But you don't have to worry. Your secret's safe with me. You're into BL, too. They had some good bulk deals here. Yeah, <laughs> Stock right. it up. Don't tell anyone at school, okay? And so, a new misunderstanding was born. Miss Tachibana was relieved because it meant that her real secret remained safe. Meanwhile online, Mr. Machio was trending hard. Several nearly nude photos of him were suddenly everywhere. I don't get it. What the heck is a muscle king? Hello, muscle. Kimi wa mou bachiri kinniku sobake ta kai? Tappuri oikonda kimi mo mada mada no kimi mo kinniku no yorokobi ni den wa nai. Issho ni kinniku o wakachao. Mazu wa kinniku no namae no kakurin kara. Itte mi yo. Macho ding. It's my song. Hey there! Are you ready to review those dumbbell curls we learned? Grab anything you can comfortably hold as a weight. About two kilograms would be just right. Whatever you're using should feel about as heavy as a large bottle of water. You can also use a bag with a handle and fill it with books or whatever you like. Sounds good! Are you ready? Stand with your feet shoulder width apart. Completely relax your shoulders. Keep elbows to the side and bend them slowly as you lift. It looks easy, but it is a challenge. Let's start with the right arm. And whenever you're ready, go! And one. Two. Lift and rotate three, your palms facing up. Four. Keep your elbows pressed to your five, side so you don't use momentum. That's six. Oh man, do you seven, feel that? Feels like your muscles are growing. And eight. Make sure you keep the rhythm. Nine, Now's when you're gonna have to push. Ten. My arms are about to fall 11. off. No, they're not. The muscle Next king will 12. give you strength. Careful not to overextend. 14. Last one. 15. Dumbbell superstar. Add this to your regular workout and those arms will be strong and firm. And always remember, fam, true strength comes from within. Don't forget about your left arm. Rock it out during the commercial break. Switching to the other hand. And here we go.